lake's usually way up there. Look how low it is. Goodness. Crazy. We're back at Lake McClure, one of my favorite lakes. Where's your net though? It's inside the locker up to get out. Oh, okay. Man, first cast with the A-Rig. Good job, dude. Oh, there's two of them. Two of them. <laughs> nice. That's why you throw the A-Rig out here, folks. Ooh, Tim with a decent fish. You don't have... Here, 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 here. Bring him, bring him. That's all right, I got him. Bring him close. I'm not gonna interfere. Just get him close, don't flip him unless you got the heavy enough line. Damn, good largemouth. Look at that, dude. Yeah, but the hook's in the chomper, you're good. Good. Good job, Tim, hold him up for the camera. Common sense fishing. Out here with Tim at Lake McClure. Good job, dude. Or got off. I don't know. Might have broke off. Felt like a good one. Damn broke it. off. You went Son for a run on you. Son of a bitch. Another one, a little spot. That's fish number four for you. You lost one earlier. I'm still struggling to get one back here. <laughs> good job. Out here at McClure, a couple on uh, some A rigs, a couple on Cinco's Nico rig, and uh, what was that, drop shot? Oh, uh, Cinco, yep. I'm tossing the drop shot, so 15 to 25, 30 feet deep. Not getting them too deep, not getting them too shallow. Beautiful day out here at Lake McClure. Stay down, baby. Stay down. On the jig? I'll show the jig. Yeah, on the jig. There you go. Right there. That'll do. Nice. Giant, Good job. I am off of the point here. At me. It's all right. Pull it at me. It's going for deeper water. On the jig? No. Oh, yeah. the Ned rig, right? Is this your first Ned rig fish in the world? Yeah, first yeah, yeah. And these are on your little, uh, you made them out of the Cinco's, huh? Yeah, I did. Cool. Good deal, dude. Bam! There you go. That'll go in there. Tim whooping me up. At least I'm putting you on the spots. <laughs> <laughs> these are some of my favorite spots, but man, you're doing a good job tearing into them, dude. Good job. Yeah, you're catching them, buddy. Good job. Well, I got the net. Yeah, you can get it. Oh, might I know. That might be a decent one. Yeah, you never know. I can't see him yet. Be out there, you know. there we go. Nice. All right. I had to throw that good old drop shot. That's all right. Margarita mutilator here at the pillars. Got mine. I've lost like four or five fish, or well, I haven't lost them, but I've missed four or five decent little bites. Doodling around, getting myself dialed in. All right, now let's get some more. Came off the bottom, huh? Yeah, dragging it right between that pillar and the boat right here. Uh -huh. Yeah, came right off the bottom. Little guy, so we're going to throw him back and uh, get some more but we're using basically bottom bouncers fishing real slow first two fish came on an a rig and then it's been bottom bouncers from there well there you go nice one a decent fish good one yeah good job dude there we go put the anchor lock on yeah oh she's on. popped right off like the one i just lost <laughs> I just not. I just lost me a nice one. I, they're probably a nice spotted bass down there. Okay. Good job. Hold them on up, Tim. Huh? Hold them on up. Hey, yeah, yeah. Good job, dude. All right. While well, we just adjusted. Good job. Might be a keeper. 
nice. Yeah, this has been holding some better fish right here. There you go. Yeah. yeah, good job. That one might need to be fizzed though. We'll do a video on that. That'll be great. Nice. I'll put this back over here. Good job. Good bag of fish. Yep, you sure did. All right, so I missed a fish, so fish number three for me. Uh, been a slow day for me on numbers. Uh, Tim's got, uh, you know, like six or seven. So we're having fun out here at Lake McClure throwing Nico rigs, drop shots, Ned rigs, and jigs. Uh, he's got two on an A rig, and we're basically just bottom bouncing, getting them anywhere from 10, 15 feet all the way down to about 40. So we'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching Common Sense Fishing. Heck yeah. <laughs> These ain't the fish we want to catch though, right? So got another one. Sorry I had GoPro off, but we're basically out here and I'm casting out basically out this way, 25, 40 feet of water, working it in slow. We're getting some bass. He's getting them more in probably the 15 foot range in between shore and the boat. So uh, let's see if we can get some more and uh, smash that subscribe and like. We'll catch you on the next fish. Oh, he popped off on the trolling motor. Oh. All right, folks, when it's getting into the winter transition or winter, you're going to be catching a lot of bass deep. You're going to need to fizz them, especially when they start bellying up. Right now, this one right here, as you can see, wants to belly up. See, this one is going to need to be fizzed. So we're going to show you guys how to do that here in a second. All right. So we're going to go ahead and show you guys and gals how to fizz a fish. So what you're going to want to do is lay the fin back. Oh, let's do this real quick here. All right, guys, how to fizz a fish, you're gonna wanna lay the fin back and count basically four scales back from the side fin here. And you're gonna wanna insert slightly at an angle and then lift up and go straight down. So you see here we have the fin. Oh. So we have the fin here, right? We're gonna lay it straight back and we're gonna count. One, two, three, four. So we're going to slightly lift that scale. Oh, it's right here. And straight down. You guys hear that? That's that pressure being released out of the fish's air bladder. Do you see the bubbles coming out? There we go. Now that fish will sit right side up. Thanks for watching Common Sense Fishing. Hope this video helps you learn how to fizz a fish. Take good care of them this winter. We'll see you guys out on the water on the next fish. Decent. Not too crazy. It's a keeper. Uh -uh. Spitting up a ton of bait. There we go. Nice. That was spitting up a ton of bait. All right. This little spot had some fight in them. All right. Out here at Lake McClure having a blast. All right. Thanks for watching Common Sense Fishing. Me and Tim out here at Lake McClure. He got himself a nice large mouth. Got a bunch of spots. Had a great day. So we're going to get these girls back in the water. And we'll tell you all about how the day went. You have fun? Had a great time. Heck Good yeah. Weather. Company wasn't too bad. <laughs> Let's go. <clears throat> this guy killed him. I caught some at the end. I did all right. Yeah, we got it.
We had a good day. Yeah, hey, beats a day in the office for sure, or in the attic or on a roof, as I'd like to say. <laughs> Absolutely. A bad so. day fishing beats any day working. Exactly. <laughs> All right, well, we'll catch you guys on the next one.